mortgage applications experience a sharp downturn and Fed leaders vote to stay the course in cutting monthly asset purchases ahead on Thursday's news wrap. Mortgage applications went into a steep dive last week, erasing hopes of a rebound stemming from stronger numbers a week earlier. The Mortgage Bankers Association reported a seasonally adjusted 9.2% decline in its application survey for the week ending June 13th, a reversal of the adjusted 10.3% increase reported in the month's first week. Examining the numbers, MBA chief economist Mike Fred and Tony pinned the blame partly on a slight rise in mortgage rates, which saw the average 30-year fixed rate climbing to 4.36%. Brad and Tony also noted tight inventories in certain markets have prevented pre-approved borrowers from being able to find a home they're interested in. Voting memberships of the Federal Open Market Committee concluded their June meeting by once again agreeing to bring down the Federal Reserve's monthly bond purchases. Taking a cue from economic strides made in the last few months, the Fed leaders voted to cut monthly purchases of agency mortgage-backed securities and Treasury securities to a combined $35 billion. Together, the cuts represent a scaling back of $10 billion in monthly additions, keeping with the committee's pace so far. If the current course continues, the so-called taper could conclude in the fall. You can check out these stories and all the latest happenings in the industry right here on our site. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again on Friday here at TheMReport.com, your source for the latest news and strategies in the evolving mortgage market.